Ultimate Dr. Sandy. Um, last year for Lent, I did 40 days of honor. So every day I would spend one day um, honoring someone that has influenced or impacted my life and making me who I am today. And um, I never want to stop doing that. I never want to stop sharing how much people have impacted or influenced me. Or People deserve to know how much mean to me and how they've influenced me and so this morning I woke up at three o'clock in the morning and I couldn't go back to sleep so I just took advantage of just the moment to lay there and not have to be anywhere but just be there and be still so so I was I was still and I prayed and meditated I'm just still and then I, I was reminded of how people tell me that I'm so positive. And I started thinking, am I? Am I really positive? Because oftentimes I see shackles and what hold people down, what hold people back from being or doing what or who they're created to be. And whether it's fears or doubts or believing lies about themselves or even about God. It's all shackles. It's all slavery. You know, and then we go through our lives wondering, like, what's our purpose? And where did our day go? Where did our life go? But, and I was just thinking about that also on Sunday morning. I was, in, I was in worship, and I was thinking how much Jesus wants freedom for us. And a lot of us just don't even know how to get there, where that even starts. Like we hear the scriptures, and we know the Sunday school things to say, or the Sunday school things we're supposed to believe. But how do we really get there, and what does it really mean that the truth sets us free? So... It was such an honor to even take your um, your two-year breakthrough biblical counseling um, program. I loved it. It changed my life. And I remember even speaking at graduation about the very thing about we hear about the truth is supposed to set us free, but what does that mean? How do you get there? Through those two years, Christ has changed my life so dramatically, and it's not just a a one-time, one-time aha or revelation, or just doing or saying the good things, the right things. But it was a continuous transformation, and it still is a continuous transformation. And through what He has done and is still doing in me, and what you've taught me how to see. has like risen such like a desire to help that with other people and it gets me excited to to help those that want to be free from their own shackles to speak life into them and to believe the best in them stop believing lies about themselves so many people want to be free And so I just laid in bed this morning so thankful for you and everything that you have imparted and not just me, but hundreds, thousands of people, I'm sure. And exponentially, I'm, sh I'm quite sure. So I just wanted to thank you for impacting me the way you have and how from this you know to this day that God still uses how you've how you've taught me to help others so thank you Dr. Sandy love you